So we have the classic twin slash doubled depending on your preference. So it's of course inside the main castle hotel. The classic room features either two single beds or one double bed with a beautiful ensuite that has a bath and a shower with luxury toiletries. Facilities include the satellite television, a desk, a trouser press and ironing board, and iron and tea and coffee making facilities. So that's our classic. Okay. Then we have our family room. So the family room is a little more spacious and it features a double and a single bed, along with that beautiful ensuite with a bath, shower and luxury toiletries. The facilities are almost the same with the TV, desk, trouser press, ironing board, tea and coffee making facilities, but the rooms also include an additional single sofa bed, so you could potentially fit four people. Perhaps you've got a lot of luggage with you and you'd like that extra space. Okay. Next we have the castle twin or double. Located in the original castle, these rooms feature either a double bed or two single beds with an ensuite with a bath and shower, bathrobes as well, and slippers, and a selection of toiletries. The facilities include the television, hair dryer, trouser press iron and ironing board, and tea and coffee making facilities. And the style of these rooms do vary. Some are traditionally furnished. They're very medieval looking, I can tell you that much. Next we have the junior suite. It's a spacious suite in the main hotel with a king bed and ensuite with bath and shower, bathrobes with luxury toiletries and slippers. It features a TV, desk, trouser press, hair dryer, ironing, ironing board, tea and coffee making facilities. And we've got two more rooms to go. We next have the Castle Premier Suite. This is generally a size suite with period features located in the castle and it features a king size bed, ensuite with bath and shower, bathrobes, slippers and luxury toiletries. It's got a TV, ironing facilities and trouser press coffee and tea making facilities along with a hair dryer and work space. And then finally, we have the castle four poster suite. The suites are located in the castle and they feature one king size four poster bed, pretty fancy, an ensuite bathroom with a bath and shower, bathroom slippers and luxury amenities, a TV, direct dial phone, trouser press, iron facilities, hair dryer and tea and coffee making facilities. Now the style and decor of these suites do vary as well. Okay, what can I tempt you with? Of course you can have the castle four poster suite. Not a problem, let me just see The McDuff Sweet. Just pop you in there. Done. Okay, now you can also have some room extras. We have a few packages that we can add in your room for you. And again, you're most welcome. We have the executive package. The amenities include bathrooms and slippers. You get 
complimentary bottled water, LMS toiletries and complimentary Wi-Fi. Then you have the Executive Plus package. Guests can enjoy a complimentary bottle of wine, chocolate truffles and a bouquet of flowers before retreating to your luxurious bed. We have the feature package. So you can enjoy some complimentary still and sparkling water with a seasonal fruit bowl and a local magazines that you can read whilst taking in the stunning views of the surrounding area. And finally we have the feature plus package. You can unwind in the spacious lounge with stunning views of the local area with complimentary wine, truffles, flowers and robes. These are all added to this package for an elegant and restful retreat. I think you ought to have the Feature Plus package. Yes, we'll get that added in. Yes, 
So, another point that makes us quite unique here is we like to scent the rooms for you with essential oils that you're going to enjoy and help you relax. So I have six different blends here to show you and you can just choose which one you would like. So, we have Relax, which contains lavender, orange, bergamot Cross your nose and you can just okay. That's a relax number one. Next we have detox. Now detox contains lemon, peppermint, thyme, and palmarosa. It's a little bit of a sharper scent, nonetheless, very delightful. Number three is muscle relief. So this just helps your muscles relax. It has rosemary, eucalyptus, and black pepper. Let's get that good sniff. And then we have rejuvenate. This contains lavender, geranium, grapefruit. So the maids will be able to add that to your room. Now, we need to just go through the uh, dinner menu along with the breakfast menu as we are a little short-staffed in the kitchen, I have to say. So the cook is asking for your meal preferences in advance. Is that okay? We can choose them now. We'll start with dinner. So dinner is a set menu and you get a choice of a starter, a main and a dessert. So let me read to you the starters, okay? So you can have traditional Scottish broth, you can have a game patty and oat cakes. You can also have Scottish kiln smoked Salmon rolled with cream cheese. You can have haggis and mushroom cup topped with a mull of Kintyre cheese on a sweet red pepper coulis. So that was. and oat cakes, a smoked salmon, or the haggis and mushroom cup. What would you like? Okay. Great choice. Next, on to the meats. You can have prime Scottish sirloin steak with a whiskey and black. Sauce. You can have a 
Island Chicken Supreme with tender haggis stuffed chicken breast coated in a rich Ayrshire blue cheese sauce. You can have grilled trout fillets with a toasted oatmeal and heather honey coated topping. Whole ham shank with a red currant and thyme gravy. Or a Scottish kiln smoked salmon salad. Or a salad without any meat or fish. What would you like? Mm. Again, excellent choice. Freshly brewed tea or coffee. That's fine. Alright. Then for your starter, for your breakfast, you've got a selection of cereals. You can have muesli, fruit salad, selection of natural and fruit yogurts, natural yogurt mixed berries in a granola pot, or homemade. The main course for breakfast. You can have a full English breakfast with pork sausage, air dried pack bacon, tomato, mushroom, black pudding, hash brown, beans, and your choice of fried, scrambled, or poached eggs. You may have a vegan English breakfast with vegan sausage, tomato, vegan black pudding, and beans. You can have a breakfast roll with pork sausage, air dried back bacon, black pudding, and hash brown. You can have a homemade omelette with the choice of the fillings, cheese, ham, mushroom, pepper, or tomatoes. You may have gluten-free pancakes with maple syrup, mixed berries, and pumpkin seeds. Or a smashed avocado and poached egg on sourdough toast. Or finally, smoked salmon, scrambled egg, and chive. Yes, of course. Um, yes. Amazing. What a lovely selection. Right, I'm just going to submit. Perfect. So that has been sent to the maze. They'll start preparing your room. It'll take about five minutes or so just for them to properly go up and just replace. 
get your pillows all sorted. In the meantime, would you like me to tell you some facts about the local Highland area? Yes, I have some here. So, the Highlands are by far the largest of region in Scotland, covering nearly 10,000 square miles. Home to stunning scenery, including the legendary Loch Ness. Population is approximately 234,000. Here are five interesting facts for you. There are three languages spoken in the Highlands English, Scots, and Gaelic. The area is divided into two parts. The Great Glen divides the Grampian Mountains to the southeast from Northwest Highlands. It has the UK's highest mountains, ranging from 900 to 1,300 meters. The Northwest Highlands are, geologically speaking, 750 million years old. Loch Ness holds more fresh water than all of the lakes in England and Wales combined. There are 258 primary and secondary schools across the Highlands. It's also home to the University of the Highlands as well made up of 13 different colleges and research institutions. The UK's most remote school is on the Scottish peninsula of Scorake. It can only be reached by boat or a winding coastal path and has only five pupils. For those Harry Potter fans, if you are, the famous Hogwarts school depicted in the films had a stage presence in the Scottish Highlands overlooking the stunning lochs and mountains. With no fewer than 47 distilleries spread across the region, the Highlands is Scotland's largest geographical whisky producing area, which is very good news if you like whisky. It makes it the region a tourism hotspot as well, as many tourists like to sample the local produce. The Highlands also has an impressive timber industry, providing sawmilling, production of pulp and paper, and the manufacture of higher value goods. The crystal clear waters surrounding the Highlands make the region among the richest in the world for fish, with important markets in places like Malek, Stornoway, Lerick, and Orbin. Fraserburgh is known as the biggest shellfish port in Europe. Islands are accessible by car, rail, bus and air as well. And you can get ferries and flights to reach this lovely area. The outdoors sports some of the world's most stunning sceneries. This region is spoiled with wonderful walks and has one of the oldest and most fascinating histories on there. The Cairngorms National Park lies at the heart of this region, offering everything from stunning hiking routes ice climbing, skiing, snowboarding and so much more. To the west you'll find the magical Isle of Skye teeming with incredible outdoor sports to explore including the famous fairy pools, the Coolin mountain range and the old man of store. You can throw in the old spot of kayaking, camping and skiing as it offers so much for everyone. The vast landscape has an undulating coastline, wild expanses, rugged mountains and islands, rushing rivers and conifer-rich woodlands. So if you love the outdoors, the islands is definitely for you. There's also legendary battlefields and museums packed with rich local history, breathtaking geological wonders. Avi Mortu which offers retail therapy and a perfect gateway to the Highland tour. And of course, the brilliant aspect of staying in the Highlands is there's a wide choice of accommodation, like this one, from wildly remote cottages to seaside villages and castles like this. And then you've got Inverness, which is a blast abundance of old and new homes. Is where you are. And that should be your room ready. Just check. We've got the green light. You're good to go. Well, I hope you have a pleasant stay.
stay with us tonight. Of course, here is your room key. Perfect. And if you've got any issues at all, just phone down to reception. I'm on all evening, so I can absolutely help you. Have a lovely sleep, and we'll see you in the morning.